Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply. This very short video is to simply uh, answer a very common question. That question is how to measure the length of a mortise cylinder. All mortise cylinders, or at least in my experience, are always measured from the underside of the head to the back of the cylinder, including the, the cam or tailpiece. So the underside of the head is when you would butt your rule to the underside of the head of the cylinder or your tape measure extended all the way back, including the cam. This happens to be a standard cam. You could have an Adams Wright cam or any other of a thousand other cams. The measurement will always be determined the same way. This cylinder, measured from the underside of the head to the back of the cam, is inch and an eighth. That is the length of this cylinder. And you can see that including the cam, it's inch and an eighth. This is known inch and an eighth, so there's no guesswork involved because, well, I know the manufacturer's stock number tells me it's inch and an eighth, which is verified by the fact that I'm measuring it and it's giving me the inch and an eighth dimension. That's how it's done, regardless of manufacturer, uh, regardless of cylinder type, cam type, keyway, quantity of cuts on the key, you know, how many, uh, uh, how it's drilled in terms of pins, underside of the head to the uh, back of the tailpiece or cam. If there's any questions on how to measure the length of a mortise cylinder or any other technical question at all, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you very much.